Hi everybody, Shelly Roth with Springboard. Welcome to another video tipster. This one is going to be about the new Facebook fan page setup. They've totally changed the way you can go in and set up your fan page. If you like what you learned today, please do go ahead and go to facebook.com forward slash Springboard Works and become a fan of Springboard. I would appreciate that. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump right in. Here's just my fan page on Facebook. Probably the easiest way to get to create a new fan page is to type in up in the browser facebook.com forward slash pages. And when you do that, you're going to pop right in and see, I'll go ahead and do that, a bunch of pages, friends and what your similar interests are, but there's a button right up here at the top, create a page. So I'm going to select create a page. And wow, look at that. This is all brand new. They've made it, they're trying to make it easier and easier for businesses to use Facebook. Yay. So you have many choices now, and probably where most people will fall is up in the top three for their business. You're either going to be a local business or place of interest, company, organization, institution, or product or brand. And what's changed is they've added a second category. So if you select local business, this is where it will ask you what your business is, and you might not see it here if it's not listed. The bottom line with a local business is it's going to ask you for hours of um, when you're open. It's going to ask you for your street address, etc. So be co cognizant of that because it will want to know if you have parking, etc. On a company, organization, or institution, a lot of people may decide to choose this category, which is relatively new, where you can actually go in and select a small business if you're a small business, a school, a travel agent, etc. This is going to be a little tougher to decide between a company and organization or a brand or product. And where most people fell into the brand or product under product or service, if you're like myself and you do consulting and training, you might be a product or service. It'll be a kind of a, up to you what you want to do coming in under this particular category or product, brand, or service. Dropping down, if you're an artist, band, or public figure, or even a writer, it actually gives an author a place to call themselves a writer here and select that category. But since most people are multifaceted, you might consider company, organization, institution, or brand. Entertainment is more for community pages. You might select an area of interest, a particular movie, or TV show, or video that you like, and you would select that, put the name of it. And lastly, if you have a cause or a topic that you want to generate, both the entertainment page and the cause or to topic page will be community pages that other people can come to via Facebook. So that really gives you a pretty good understanding of how you would go ahead and set up a new Facebook fan page or business page using the new Facebook setup. If you like what you learned, please stop by, become a fan, ask any questions on my wall. And also you can join my mailing list if you're not already on it on the, the uh, join us on my Springboard Works fan page. This is Shelley Roth. Thanks so much for joining us. Have a great day.